to screencast with Google Meet, here's what you do. You go ahead and start a meet. Once you're in your meeting, you're going to click join now. And in order for you to screencast, you're going to need to record the session. So click the three dots and click record meeting. Ask for consent and click accept. Now notice I don't have any guests in my Google Meet. And yet, in the top left corner, it says I'm recording even though I don't have anyone here. So now that you see the red recording button in the corner, um, you can now present your screen. So I'm going to click present now in the bottom right, my entire screen. Select this, click share. You're going to see this tab go black and it says you're presenting to everyone and I'm recording. So now I can go to a Google slideshow. I can click present, and here's what's going to happen. It's going to record my slideshow. It's going to record the audio from my voice. So you can go through your slides. If you play video, they may not be able to hear it. Now, in addition to Google slides, you can also take your audience to any other place on the internet and give a narrative about um, anything you want. For example, I could take you to my Google Classroom and show you what I posted for my announcements. I could go into classwork and I could explain what I did for week one, what I did for week two. I could open any of these assignments, read you the description, um, show you the resources I've attached, and so on. So you could give a mini tour of pretty much anything on the internet. But let's press exit. Let's press stop sharing. So now I'm no longer sharing my screen, but I'm still recording. And now I need to click on the three dots and stop recording. Yeah. I'm going to click stop recording. And the recording will now be saved in my Google Drive. Can you say hi? Hi.